Welcome back to Squawk Box. Time now for the Executive Edge. Bitcoin volatility, it has returned. The cryptocurrency plunging as low as $3,500. It's now rebounded a little bit on Wednesday and Thursday, but now down sharply again. It's under 4000 Last night, I spoke with SEC Chairman Jay Clayton about the challenges that he's been facing trying to regulate the world of cryptocurrencies and how he thinks about it. We tried to get the word out that although the trading looks like the trading you would see on NASDAQ or on the New York Stock Exchange, these markets do not have the same kind of safeguards for you. Um, we've worked for you know, 50, 60, 70 years to try and prevent manipulation in those markets, to try and prevent people from, from taking advantage of the small player. Um, it's what we do, but the markets that you know, these, these things originally traded on, they didn't have those safeguards. And I, I made it also clear to people that if you're sending your money offshore and something goes wrong, there's very little we can do to get it back right. as a practical matter. Well, so let me, let me ask you about that. And, what, what and, you and, and I hope people heeded that. I hope they didn't you know, use their credit card to buy some kind of offshore token um, without really, really, really thinking about it. You know, I got to tell you, I had always thought that the next inflection point for crypto was going to be some form of some form of positive regulation from the government that something would be coming after that conversation i was less inclined to believe that actually at least on the sec side that there's something coming that actually what has to happen is not that the government or the law has to sort of shift to work with crypto but that effectively what he was saying is crypto is going to have to change its technology to work with the law if you will